Hello everyone. So let us generate the step definition for scenario outline. As we know that based on the header name, it will identify that which column value should be supplied to the corresponding step during the runtime. And also I'm going to make this as a string because I want to receive the data in the form of string in this step definition. So now the argument type will be string in the step definition method. So once this is done, open your runner, change the dry run flat to true and execute it. So this will generate the step definition method for us and I will keep inside the step definition file. So here I will just print the value which is coming from the feature file from the example data table. So string.format which is a method for formatting the output. So value and this will be your parameter name. Similarly for the other step definition method. Now once this is done, I will change the dry run flag to false and execute it. So if you look at the console, it has printed all the value which is coming from the data table defined under the example. Okay, and based on the header name, it has identified that which column value should be supplied to which step. Also here you can see the scenario outline, which is this one got executed three times. Okay, and for every set of data. So inside our example data table, we have three rows excluding the header row. So the scenario outline executed all the step three times for every set of data which is present inside the example. So this is for the first set execution. And as you can see here, it has already replaced the column name with the value which is being supplied in this step during the runtime. So this is are the values. And similarly for the second set of value and similarly for the third set of value. And also at the console you can see these are the output. So in this manner, you can use the scenario outline when you want to run the entire scenario for a different set of data. As I told you earlier, this is really helpful when you're doing the data driven testing where you want to run your same scenario again different against the different set of data.